Ladies and gentlemen, I'm excited to present to you the harmonic armature according to Schneider. Uh, James Kalman uh, pointed me in the direction of a painter named Sh William Schneider, and he considers the harmonic armature when painting. So what I'd like to do is just take you through a few images. You can see clearly that the harmonic armature, especially right with that belt buckle, is lining up. Again, uh, you can't tell me that uh, just a coincidence that these arms and legs are situated in these particular arrangements. Here we have another Schneider. Um, and in the middle, you can see that that's being framed very nicely. Uh, over on the right-hand side, you can see Schneider sitting down. And check out that diagonal that goes up his tie and uh, right at the collar there. And uh, just wrapping things up here, you can see that Bo and Luke Duke are definitely framed within the harmonic armature. And look, look at how Daisy's uh, head tilt is framed. And there's interesting little coincidences at the, at the uh, intersections. You can just take a look at any two or three intersections of lines and see what happens there. And again, um, sometimes the harmonic armature can be shifted over. Take a look at the shadows. Schneider here and then his ear but if you just slide it over a little bit into the middle it's still interesting it's because the camera is panning left and right and look at you know how the uh, the mantle and the fireplace and the picture frame all lines up and it looks like the camera level is right at the height of the mantle level and again if you just shift it over a little bit you can see what else lines up look at his nipple there at the intersection and here finally framing the entire uh, well thank you for tuning in and uh, we'll see you next time